42 minus 28. That is 4 tenths 2 units minus 2 tenths 8 units. Now 8 cannot be subtracted from 2. So 4 tenths 2 units is same as 3 tenths 12 units. 12 minus 8 is 4. And 3 minus 2 is 1. So 42 minus 28 is 14. 82 minus 49. That is 8 tenths 2 units minus 4 tenths 9 units. 9 cannot be subtracted from 2. So 8 tenths 2 units can be written as 7 tenths 12 units. 12 minus 9 is 3. And 7 minus 4 is 3. So 82 minus 49 is 33. 85 minus 56. That is 8 times 5 units minus 5 times 6 units. 6 cannot be subtracted from 5. So 8 times 5 units can be written as 7 times 15 units. Now 15 minus 6 is 9. 7 minus 5 is 2. So 85 minus 56 is 29. 92 minus 78. That is 9 tenths 2 units minus 7 tenths 8 units. Now 9 tenths 2 units can be written as 8 tenths 12 units. 12 minus 8 is 4. And 8 minus 7 is 1. So, 92 minus 78 is 14. 99 minus 39. That is 9 times 9 units minus 3 times 9 units. 9 units minus 9 units is 0. 9 times minus 3 times is 6 times. So, 99 minus 39 is 16. 62 minus 27. That is 6 tenths 2 units minus 2 tenths 7 units. Now 12 minus 7 is 5. And 5 minus 2 is 3. So 62 minus 27 is 35. Subtraction. If Anaga has planted 27 of the 45 trees, how many does she still have to plant? Anaga wants to plant 45 trees. She has already planted 27 trees. Trees she still need to plant would be 45 minus 27. Now 45 means 4 times 5 units minus 27, which further means 3 times 15 units. Now from 15 units, if you subtract 7 units, you get 8 units. From 3 times, if you subtract 2 times, you are left with 1 ten. So 45 minus 27 is 18. She has to plant 18 trees more. If Sumit has finished reading 39 of the 52 pages in the storybook, how many are remaining? Now the number of pages of storybooks are 52. Sumit has finished reading 39 pages. In order to find the remaining pages, we will subtract 39 from 52. That is 5 tenths 2 units minus 3 tenths 9 units. You cannot subtract 9 from 2. Now 5 tenths 2 units 
would be as same as 4 times 12 units. Now 12 units minus 9 units is 3 units. 4 times minus 3 times is 1 times. So 52 minus 39 is 13. Which means the number of pages left are 13. Ajay has already given the feed to 13 of the 32 cows in the cow shed. How many cows are still to be fed? Total number of cows are 32. Ajay has already fed 13 cows. In order to find out the number of cows still to be fed, we will subtract 13 out of 32. That is 3 times 2 units minus 1 times 3 units. Now 3 times 2 units is same as 2 times 12 units. Now 12 units minus 3 units is 9 units. And 2 times minus 1 ten is 1 ten. So 32 minus 13 is 19. So 19 cows are still to be fed. Hassan collected 50 seeds. 25 of them are chiku seeds. How many seeds are of other fruits? Total number of seeds Hassan collected 50. Out of these, chiku seeds are 25. Now, the seeds of other fruits would be 50 minus 25, that is 5 times 0 units minus 2 times 5 units. You cannot subtract 5 from 0. So, 5 times 0 units can be written as 4 times 10 units. Now 10 units minus 5 units is 5 units. Now 4 tens minus 2 tens is 2 tens. So that means it is 2 tens 5 units that is 25. So the seeds of other fruits are 25. Subtract 25 minus 18. Now that is 2 tens 5 units minus 1 ten 8 units. If you look at units column, you cannot subtract 8 from 5. So you will untie 1 ten in the 2 tens. Now 5 units will become 15 units. So 2 tens 5 units are now 1 ten 15 units. Now 15 minus 8 is 7. 1 minus 1 is 0. So 25 minus 18 is 7. Now next is 27 minus 19. Which means 2 tens 7 units minus 1 ten 9 units. 9 cannot be subtracted from 7. So, from 2 tens we will untie 1 ten and 2 tens 7 units will become 1 ten 17 units. Now, 17 minus 9 is 8. And 1 ten minus 1 ten is 0. So, 27 minus 19 is 8. Thirty-one minus eighteen. That means three tens one unit minus one ten eight units. Now eight cannot be subtracted from one. So we'll make three ten one unit as two tens eleven units. 
Now, 11 minus 8 is 3. And 2 minus 1 is 1. So, 31 minus 18 is 13. 41 minus 24. That is 4 tenths 1 unit minus 2 tenths 4 units. Now, 4 cannot be subtracted from 1. So, 4 tenths will become 3 tenths. And 1 unit will become 11 units. Now, 11 units minus 4 units would be equal to 7. 3 minus 2 is 1. So, 41 minus 24 is 17. 45 minus 37. That is 4 times 5 units minus 3 times 7 units. Now, 4 tenths would become 3 tenths and 5 units would become 15 units. 15 minus 7 is 8. And 3 minus 3 is 0. So 45 minus 37 is 8. Fifty-two minus thirty-nine. That is five tenths two units minus three tenths nine units. Nine cannot be subtracted from two, so we will make five tenths two units as four tenths twelve units. Now twelve minus nine is three, and four minus three is one. So fifty-two minus thirty-nine is thirteen. 55 minus 38, that is 5 times 5 units minus 3 times 8 units. Now here, 5 times 5 units is same as 4 times 15 units. Now 15 minus 8 is 7 and 4 minus 3 is 1. So 55 minus 38 is 17. 61 minus 42. That is 6 times 1 unit minus 4 times 2 units. Now, 6 times 1 unit is same as 5 times 11 units. 11 minus 2 is 9 and 5 minus 4 is 1. So, 61 minus 42 is 19. 63 minus 57. That is 6 times 3 units minus 5 times 7 units. Now, 6 times 3 units can be written as 5 times 13 units. Now, 13 minus 7 is 6 and 5 minus 5 is 0. So, 63 minus 57 is 6. 72 minus 49. That is 7 times 2 units minus 4 times 9 units. Now, 7 times 2 units can be written as 6 times 12 units. 12 minus 9 is 3 and 6 minus 4 is 2. So 72 minus 49 is 23. 75 minus 38. That is 7 times 5 units minus 3 times 8 units. Now, 7 times 5 units is equal to 6 times 15 units. Now, 15 minus 8 is 7 and 6 minus 3 is 3. So, 75 minus 38 is 37.